I don't know. Maybe. Okay. Go ahead. The Earth's gravity can, can, is controlled by the, the neutral space of Earth. What? Uh, say, say that once again. The, the gravity is controlled by, the, by, the, by space in Earth. Hmm. And that's your, that's your take on science, huh? Yes. Now, you can ask me a few questions. Okay. So what do you think about this whole adoption thing? What, what do you think? Hmm. I think it's pretty much only good because I can beat you up and... <laughs> you can beat me up? Yeah. So now you think it's legal for you to beat me up because we adopted you? Yes. Oh, be, how about before? Well, before... It was still, it was still illegal. I just did, you just now you now you can't tell me around. <laughs> oh, I can't I can't tell I can't tell you around. Yeah. Oh, you I, are so wrong. I meant you can't <laughs> boss me around. Oh, like, I can. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> All right, ask me another question. Why do kids have to go to school? Uh, because they because they have to learn. Yeah, how, why are they stupid? No, <laughs> they just they just have to learn more stuff to get oh. a good job and stuff. Yeah, that is right. All right. And what grade are you in now? Uh, that would be kindergarten. And how much left you got to uh, kindergarten? I got another month or so. And then, and then what? And then I'll be in first grade. Cool. All right. Now ask me something about space, or, space or Earth or something. Why is the Earth round? Uh, because if it wasn't, because if it wasn't round, it when it, it would just everything would be flat if it wasn't round. <laughs> oh, duh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I guess so. Um, who's your favorite smart person of all times in history? Who do you think is the smartest person to ever live? Uh, yeah. Uh, duh, the smartest scientist in the world. Yeah, what's his name? You don't, I, you don't know? Well, how do you know he's the smartest scientist? Because... What did he invent? Oh! What's the, what's the greatest invention ever? Light. Mm, yeah, that's a good one. Electricity? Yeah. Electric light? Yep. Who, who invented that, you think? I think... What do you think his name was? A... No. Not Abe Lincoln, no. He was a president. Yes. Um... I don't know. Thomas... Thomas Jefferson. <clears throat> no, he was a president, too. Darn it! <laughs> How about Thomas Edison? Oh, yeah. He invented a bunch of stuff. You know yeah. You know anything else he invented? What? Oh. A microwave. Okay. Yeah, maybe. Maybe his grandkid did. Okay. And... How do you like being a grandkid? Eh, it's okay. It's all right? Yeah. What's the best thing about being a grandkid? That you, that you can do a lot more stuff. Like what? Like, you can jump and play <laughs> and... You, can, you can't do that unless you're a grandkid? Well, you can. Hmm. Do that, but it's but it's easier. To, but you're since you're and if you fall down, it doesn't hurt so bad because you're because you're shorter. No. Oh. Now ask now ask me now ask me uh, who's the who's the best who's the best movie actor. Who is the best movie actor? Easy, John Afron. Who? John Afron. Who the heck is that? I meant. Never heard of him. Okay. I'm glad you didn't say Johnny Test. Yeah. <laughs> What's the best TV show ever? It would have to be Ninjago. Ninjago. Yeah. Nah, I don't know that one. Well, I know. What's the best present you ever got? Uh, it would have to be. What? Well, I can I can answer that, man. You had too so many good ones. Yeah. They're all awesome. Yeah. Hmm. Where's your favorite place to visit? Uh. 
Chuck E. Cheese. <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese? Yeah. Oh, man, you got to get out more often. I was, I was kind of talking about like when you go on vacation. Oh, then I would, then that would be, hmm. What's the coolest place you ever got to go visit? Mm, if I said it, if I would answer that, it would be Idaho, Minnesota. Idaho and Minnesota? They're yeah. both fun? Yeah. Yeah. So. Now ask me about space. <laughs> okay, how about space? How about that space? What do you got to say about that? Hmm. Tell, tell Grandma everything she ever wanted to know about space. What did you ever want to know about space? <laughs> <laughs> You're supposed to tell me everything yeah. about well, space. Well, he's he's asking you. He, he oh. wants he wants to know what you want to know. Hmm. I want to know how far it is to Venus. Oh, well that would be like 5,000 5, feet up and then to Venus, after 5,000 feet you would go that, you would go. Go that way? Which way is that? That's north, I think. Hmm. How do you, you don't have your compass? No. Hmm. Sorry. So 500 feet up and then head north? Yeah. And that takes you right to Venus? Well, I, well, you probably have to go by the comets and stuff. <laughs> okay. Man, I'm glad you're not in charge of the space program. Really? <laughs> <laughs> We'd be in big trouble. You got a lot to learn in school probably yet. probably get an airplane. <laughs> but I'm glad you like science and space. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool stuff, huh? Mm-hmm. It's bestie. It's What's cool. your favorite sport? That would have to be basketball. The one you've never played, huh? Yeah. <laughs> All right, got anything else to say? Uh, yeah. I, I, lo I like talking to you, and the person that's videoing this is Grandpa Mike. And what about him? And he's the... He's the biggest loser in the world. <laughs> oh, good night, oh, everybody. Good night. Oh, oh, you're a dead, oh. you're a dead man. <laughs> the camera's going down, and so are you. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> ah, we got him.